Hey you guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I want to do a hair tutorial on how I curl my hair. Um, right now I just have my hair parted down the middle. I've worn my hair straight uh, for a couple days. I want to say since Friday my hair has been straight. So it's been a couple days already. Um, it's due for a wash, but I figured let me just curl my hair really quick just to show you guys how I do it. First thing I'm going to do is use a heat protector. My favorite one is this Olive Oil 2-in-1 Heat Defense and Shine Mist. So I'm just going to do just two pumps and just go halfway and whatever's left I'll put on the top because I don't want my top of my hair to be super greasy and y'all gonna have to excuse these edges they will be laid at the end of this video okay so now that the hair has a little mist I'm gonna go take a whole chunk out pin it Okay, so usually I would just flat iron the, you know, the top just to make sure it's all straight. Since I think this is a little bit too thick, well, maybe I'll be able to finesse it. Whatever. Anyways, I go um, about halfway, and I want to just let you guys know that my hair is all different lengths. We're not gonna judge it. Okay, my hair fell out, grew back. It's the struggle I'm living. So about here. I'll just turn it this way. Make sure that the bottom is all getting heated because if not, if they're not getting heated, they're going to be straight parts. So there's that. And you're going to pretty much do the same process all throughout the head. You like to curl. Well, you have to curl. You know what? I'm going to say half. You should just curl away from your face. It frames the face really nicely when the curls are that way. Okay, so now I'm going to take a chunk of that. And like I said, pretty much a little bit more than halfway down. And you're going to do that slowly but surely. My flat iron's at 450 because I'm a savage. Just if you guys were curious. So there's that. Hoping this chunk is not too thick. Um, the bottom I like to leave straight just a little it makes the hair look like beach curls in my opinion so Again, always curling away from your face. When you get this type of issue where you feel like the curl is way like stretched and not curly all the way through, I go through it again. And again, it's still straight on the bottom, so right there. You wanna get it at a curve. There we go, más o menos.
This one I'm going to cut in half just because it's kind of thick. That one I'm curling all the way through. That's the only part of my hair that I curl all the way through and don't leave straight is the bang part. So we're gonna leave that there. When we're done with the other side, I'm going to, um, you'll just have to see. Now that my hair is curled, first thing I put is hairspray. And now that that's done, I'm going to use this. My baby Christine taught me this. This is Garnier Fructis um, Brilliantine Shine Glossing Spray. to brush my hair with this wide tooth comb. This does not damage the curls, not one bit. Now the back, you've got to really comb it through lightly, of course. But blend it because remember, if you're like me where it comes out good on one side and on the other side, you want it to all kind of look like it meshes together. So, um, And then the edge control that I'm using is Hicks. They don't look the same. They don't look the same. Okay, kind of. Whatever. This is how the hair looks. This is a finishing product, and I'll show you the back so you guys can see how it looks like. If you like this video, please just give a like, leave a comment down below. Subscribe, share my shit, you know the deal, and I will see you guys in the next video. See you guys soon.